Hi, this is Leah from the House Divided office at Dickinson College, here to show you how to use Quora. Quora is a question and answer site where you have the ability to review answers and get open and expert feedback on your questions and answers. And as you can imagine, that would be really useful for our course, which is all about open collaboration. So first you're going to log into the Gilder Lambert website and access the course syllabus. And it's really important that you remember that everything for this course is listed on the course syllabus. Everything that you need, including um, websites and the weekly Quora questions. So use this as your home base. To access the Quora questions, you're going to go down to Readings. And the first thing you'll notice um, about Quora is that Professor Pinsker posted his first blog post um, on the Understanding Lincoln blog at Quora, and it's called Measuring MOOCs. So let's click on that. Now you want to make sure that you follow this blog, um, and then scroll down. And after you read it, you have the ability to comment on it. This is if you offer your own unique um, interpretation or question. If you find somebody else's that you thought was really a great comment and you agreed with it, or you found it very controversial and you wanted to reply to their comment, you would click Reply. Um, if you really like somebody's comments, you have the ability to upvote it, and if you want to be really mean and you don't like it, you can always downvote it. Now, you also want to make sure that you follow the Understanding Lincoln blog right here, and also Professor Pinsker. That way, they just show up really easily later on. Next, we're going to show you how to access the weekly question. So again, under the Readings tab, you're going to come down here to Discussion Question. And every week, Professor Pinsker will post a question that you can answer. So these are open-ended questions, um, so you obviously can offer your own interpretation. To reply, you're going to click Comment, and you're going to answer his question in here and comment. And again, you have the ability to reply to other people's comments and upvote and downvote once those comments appear. Now, you're going to learn how to write your own question. So you're going to come up here to this Write tab and click Add Question. And this is if you have a specific question that you want to open up to the entire group or if you want to ask Professor Pinsker himself. So really important, you need to make sure that the topic is Understanding Lincoln. And this is going to connect it right to our course. You can also add more topics later, like Abraham Lincoln or history, and that will open it up to a broader, um, the broader community, but this will open it right up to our course. So your question could be, and as you can see, it shows you um, suggestions of questions that have already been asked, but nobody's asked my question, so I'm just going to leave it like that. You can add details about your question, and then you're going to click Add Question. After you've added your question, you can ask a specific person, and this is how you ask Professor Pinsker. So you're going to click Find People, and this is why it's important to follow him so that his name shows up right away. And I'm going to click his name, and it's as simple as that. I just asked him my question. Now, I have the ability, if I don't like the question, to delete it. I would go to Options and Delete. I can always edit this question later um, here and add question details. So you can come back and edit this question. Um, finally, you're going to learn how to write your own blog posts on Quora. Now, there's two ways to do this. Um, so far, people have been posting it on the Understanding Lincoln blog, um, which is okay, but it's preferable that you actually create your own blog with your own posts and invite people to follow you. Um, if you want to post to the Understanding Lincoln blog, it should be something that's really ambitious and that you want everybody to see. So. To create your own blog, you're going to come to Write, and then Create Blog. You can name your blog, you can set it to private if you'd like, and then invite in certain people to come see it. You'll give it a URL, and your topic will again be Understanding Lincoln, and you can write a description, and then you're going to click Create Blog, which I've already done, so I'm not going to do it myself. Then to write a post in your blog, you're just going to come here 
to write posts and you're going to add a title and your text here. Again, the topic will be understanding Lincoln and you'll post. Well, that's about it to using Quora. I hope this has been helpful and if you have any more questions, please feel free to comment on this video or to contact Lancer Professor Pinsker.